What's good, YouTuber? This is Eric from Music Computer Solutions. It's benchmark and performance test between the iPhone 7, right? And we got the OnePlus 3. So uh, when it comes down to performance and benchmark test, this is supposed to be the best of the best. So get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. up guys this is eric again with another video so today i got the one plus three and i got the iphone 7. the one plus three guys the reason why i picked this device is because every time i run benchmark tests this device is king supreme uh, as far as app opening as far as performance but the six gigs of ram and all the belgian whistles the one plus three beats the, the Galaxy S7, the Galaxy Note 7, all the devices out there in my benchmark test so yours may vary I got the, uh, the the iPhone 7, right? So today we're going to run four benchmark tests. GFX Benchmark, Antutu Benchmark, 3D Mark, and Geekbench 4. So I got all the devices preloaded with the benchmark test, right? So let's make sure we don't have nothing running in the background. Nothing running in the background so we can have a fair comparison here between both devices, right? So our first... Uh, test that we're going to run is GFX Benchmark. All right, guys. So in this test, we only going to run the T-Rex test uh, on both devices. So we're going to start the test. Now, uh, both devices, guys, uh, the OnePlus 3 have uh, the Snapdragon 820 processor with 6 gigs of RAM. Uh, the new iPhone 7 has uh, the 810 Fusion uh, processor that's what they calling it uh, we have two gigs of RAM here so we're going to run the test and see what scores we get with both devices all right guys so the scores is done we got the iPhone 7 with the A10 uh, processor uh, we have 57 frames per second look at that 57 fr 57 frames per second on the, the T-Rex test and the OnePlus 3 59 frames per second still King Supreme uh, so, uh, on this benchmark test, by a few, but it is a win, the OnePlus 3. So, let's go to get out of that, and let's clear that out. All right, let's clear that out, and let's go to the next benchmark test, and we're going to go to Antutu Benchmark. All right, guys, so we're going to try to do this second benchmark test, but unfortunately, it's crashing on the iPhone 7. Uh, so we tried to do an Antutu benchmark test, uh, and unfortunately, uh, it's crashing. Now, I went to the App Store, and they do have uh, another benchmark test, and you got to pay for it. It's, it's totally different from the benchmark test here. So let me show you guys real quick the benchmark test on the OnePlus 3, which is the Antutu benchmark, which I scored 139588. And the benchmark test on the iPhone 7 once I hit it, and uh, unfortunately it's crashing. Uh, so uh, I, I uninstalled it and I reinstalled it, and uh, I'm still getting crashes. So that's okay. Let's go to the next one. Uh, let's clear out that app there, uh, and um, we'll go clear it out. All right. So we're going to go to 3D Mark, and we're going to do uh, the slingshot here. Uh, from uh, 3D Mark, I believe that's the one that I have on the OnePlus 3, which is right. All right, so we're going to run that benchmark test, and let's go on to see what it's all about. All right, guys, so we're running into some more issues here, uh, uh, and I'm trying to run the slingshot uh, benchmark test, and let me go ahead and turn the volume down on the OnePlus 3, uh, and I have Slingshot Extreme on this device and on this device, and I try to run it. Uh, unfortunately, that's crashing. So we got two failed tests here. Uh, and again, you can download these separately here. So, uh, uh, wow, it's not looking too good for the iPhone 7 right now. Uh, so this one is running fine right here. Unfortunately, uh, wow, booyah. So... Uh, let's go ahead on and reboot the iPhone 7 uh, while the 3D mark is uh, playing here and see if that would help 
uh, in this uh, catastrophe that we got going on uh, as far as the benchmark tests not running on the iPhone 7. All right, guys, so I have a fresh boot on the iPhone 7, so let's see if we can run the benchmark test here again on this device. Unfortunately, uh, you can't run uh, the slingshot here on this device. So, uh, yeah, you can't run. This is the second benchmark test here, guys. Um, there we go. So, it's saying launch app and uh, trying to launch the app here, guys. And uh, it's taking me back to 3D Mark. Booyah! So, uh, unfortunately, uh, we can't run the second benchmark test on the iPhone 7. So uh, we're going to give the OnePlus 3 a pass on this one. Then we're going to stop it because we, we're not going to let that run. And let's go on the clear out apps. And let's uh, try, let's see. Let's clear it out. All right, so we're going to try to run um, the uh, our Geek Pinch 3 on both devices. All right, so uh, it's, it's, it's giving us all the specs. Uh, 820 processor, we got the 810 Fusion, all the bells and whistles, two gigs of RAM, six uh, six gigs of RAM perspectively on both devices. So we are going to run the benchmark test. Here we go. All right, guys. So Geekbench 4 is done here. So uh, let's go down and look at the scores perspectively here. Uh, the OnePlus 3 had a single core score of 1730 and a multi-core score of 4182. And the iPhone 7 has a single core of uh, 3459 and 5591. So uh, looking at the, all four benchmark tests, the OnePlus 3 beat uh, the, the iPhone 7 in one benchmark test. And the last benchmark test that we ran here, the, the iPhone 7 beats the OnePlus 3. But we had two benchmark tests that crashed, uh, which is a 3D mark and um, the other benchmark test, which is Antutu 2 benchmark. Uh, so uh, overall, maybe the developers have to update uh, the apps uh, to uh, uh, as far as for what the uh, iPhone 7. So we got uh, two and two that worked and we got one for one here. All right, so let's go ahead and open up some apps here and uh, see which device open up apps the fastest. So we're going to go into our uh social media here real quick and we go open up some apps and see which device open up faster so we're gonna make sure that every app is closed give it a fair shake here uh so we go to our social media and we go open up twitter first all right so the one plus three open up twitter faster than the iphone 7. all right let's go ahead and open up facebook All right, so Facebook opened up faster uh, on the, the OnePlus 3, even though we got an update, but it still opened up faster than uh, the iPhone 7. All right, so let's go ahead and open up Instagram. All right, so Instagram opened up uh, 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 the same time, a little half faster on the OnePlus 3 versus the iPhone 7. All right, so let's go to YouTube uh, on both devices. Our last app is YouTube, so let's do that. And boom. All right, so YouTube opened up faster than the OnePlus 3. All right, so overall, guys, you got you get to see the performance and the benchmark test on both devices. I mean, you had all the, all the apps open up faster on the OnePlus 3, except uh, Instagram. Instagram kind of opened up a little hair faster on the OnePlus 3, but kind of a tie. But all the rest of the apps open up faster on the OnePlus 3. So, Y'all guys kind of be the judge for yourself. Which device is King Supreme? The OnePlus 3 still, in my opinion, the best performing device of 2016. And I mean, when it comes down to benchmark tests and everything else, yes, the iPhone 7 did beat uh, the, uh, the OnePlus 3 in um, the Geekbench 4. But overall, uh, when the apps crashing and all that stuff like that, you know, you can't give this kind of competition a fair shake until you get all the results of all the benchmark tests. But when they come down to performance, the app opening, the OnePlus 3 definitely opened up apps faster than the iPhone 7. This is Eric from Music Computer Solutions. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the benchmark testing performance of both devices. See you guys on the next video. Peace.